YouTube it's your girl fluffy welcome to my channel and here I am I'm gonna do a two-in-one review for you guys yeah thought I put two reviews into one video so the first ones the two reviews are gonna be on two products that I hauled this week and if you're wondering what they are is one is the vol voluptuous volume oh ugh, can't speak Voluptuous. I'm used to the word voluptuous now. Um, <laughs> Valumizing <laughs> or valumous. Oh God, I can't can't read today or spell. I can't. You know what? I've just been noticing lately. I am not capable of pronunciation these days. So please just deal with me and work with me. Voluminous magma mascara. Okay. Now, uh, what I like about this mascara is the fact that. I like the wand. I really like the wand, and I like that it's extremely dark. It's a very black, true black mascara. That's the one thing I like about it. Um, everybody keeps giving this so many rave reviews that I was like, I gotta go get this mascara. It must be a miracle. Um, but no, it wasn't. Not for me, at least. It didn't perform the way I wanted to or expected it to. Um, the only thing I really did like about it was the fact that it, the wand itself. Yeah, let me show you what it looks like here looks like that this is what I liked about it and the other thing was I like this I kinda like how the wand does all this although I just wished it was a little bit firmer so when I go like this and scrape off excess mascara it doesn't bend so easily but overall I that's the, those are the only two things that I liked about this mascara but as far as it doing anything like amplify my lashes it didn't do that, so yeah, that's a no. It's not a repurchase item for me. But like I've always said in a lot of my videos when I do reviews on mascaras, I'm never really impressed by any mascara because none of them ever do as I expect them to. Okay, review number two. Totally new to this. I um as you guys have always known, I told you that I always apply my foundation with um a foundation brush. This is the one that I use, and this is by Real Techniques. I love this brush. I have been using this brush for like almost, I would say a year almost or two. And um, this is how I've been applying my foundation. But um, as you guys probably know and have followed, if you are following me on Instagram, you would have seen that I had just recently hauled the Real Techniques um, beauty, beauty sponge. And this is what it looks like. Okay, this it looks like, yeah, you can tell I used it today. And so this is the first time I used it and I applied my foundation today with it. And I have to admit, I really am impressed with it. Um, it performed in a way that I was not expecting. It was so light and so airy when I applied my foundation that I was just like, wow, really? Really, I was just like totally blown away by its performance. Um, this was only $5.99 at uh, Ulta, and I think it's also uh, at their Ulta website. You can also get it there. Um, but the fact that it was only $5.99 was a really, really good bargain to me. So, yeah, I could not resist picking it up and trying it out for that price. Um, I was really impressed on how soft this is. Like, I was just like, wow, this is, like, so amazingly soft. And I was wondering if this was going to apply the right amount of foundation that I'm used to to give me full coverage that I'm so used to getting with my foundation brush uh, which is also Real Techniques. This is Real real, real Techniques and this is Real, real te te Techniques. So I was like, oh, ta -ta. yeah, I'm speech impaired. Uh, oh, actually, I really am. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, but I was really truly impressed on how much, how little product I used on my face and how it, it performed. So if you are wondering whether or not to invest $5.99 on a Real Techniques foundation um, sponge or Miracle Complexion sponge, if that's what it's called here, I would truly recommend this. I am a, a real big fan and I think this is going to be how I'm going to be applying my foundation from now on unless I'm this is dirty and then I have my backups of course as always but yeah I recommend you guys to really try out this um, this uh, I, I guess what it's called complexion miracle complexion sponge that's what they're calling it um, now my other curiosity is does this perform just as good as a beauty blender of course you all know that's the the high-end version of this which runs about 20 bucks and over so yeah 
Um, if you're wondering whether or not to invest the $5.99 into a Real Techniques uh, complex, Miracle Complexion Sponge, invest. I think this is really, really worth the $5.99. All right. Thank you, YouTube, for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you are interested in seeing more reviews. Please leave your comments down below. Don't forget to, to thumbs up me. And if you are interested in other things, because sometimes I don't do haul videos sometimes or I don't always do product reviews on every little item that I get, please follow me on Instagram at Fluffy7285 and at Pinterest and on Tumblr. And leave your comments there if you are interested in... Uh, something that maybe I, I don't do a review on and I will do a review for you guys and let you know what I actually thought of that product that I purchased. Thank you so much for being loyal subscribers and followers and I love you guys a great deal. Peace out of my love to you from Fluffy and I'll check you out on my next video. Mwah!